When I first arrived in Onslow, there actually really wasn't a lot, if anything, for young people to do um, after school hours, unless it was under their own steam. Face One's Chevron partnership allows us to deliver over seven programs in Onslow. So we are interacting with a wide group of community from kindy kids up to our high school kids and even whole families. Chevron provide us with our funding for our shooting goal students. My name's Taylor and I'm doing the sport set and rec course. So we get to learn how to like different skills with coaching and like working with kids and the stuff that's required to do that. With our remote location, without the help of the VS1 staff and the ability of them to assess this program, it was something that we wouldn't be able to run. We don't have the staffing to be able to run all of those programs ourselves, so having them in the schools is hugely beneficial to exposing those kids to those skills at an early age. And they're also working with our fours to sixes in regards to the JET program, so join, engage and thrive. So sort of looking at active learning, and we're getting some really good outcomes from those programs. We do sports and some writing what you do about sport and we help each other out and get. Jet Kids is our new FMS program which is fundamental movement skills. Chevron provide us with opportunities for our Jet Kids to do things they wouldn't normally do in school. When you look at a fundamental movement skill it's so much more than what you see. So balance um, takes in the inner ear, it takes in visual, strength in their legs, strength in their core. It's not just that standing on one leg that you see, there's so much behind that one movement. As always, you know, the earlier you can intervene with any students in regards to learning, movement, social emotional, the earlier you can intervene, the, the better it is in the long term. My name's Tia Kemp and I'm at Youth Sports. After school we normally come down on Thursdays. We come in, um, get warmed up, just shoot around, have some fun playing and then we'll have a break so we have some fruit and then we'll get into our like normal dodgy game and our normal basketball game. So the kids are now able to go to activities that are set up, a bit of movement and sort of working together you know, in a space where they might not mix in that same group at school. It's Friday and we just play basketball and have, uh, have so fun sausage rolls. Have fun and have sausage rolls. All well, the kids just come down, shoot hoops and, that, and have a barbecue. A bit more fun in Onslow and that. Yeah. Liven the night up and that. If we would not have this Friday, I would have been bored. I've noticed now that it's not just the kids getting involved, the parents in this community are actually getting more involved with their children in after school sports. My name's Danny Wright. I'm just one of the parents that come on Saturday just to help out with the kids, a bit of coaching, ball collecting, just make sure they're all in the right places at the right times. As a parent, I just like to come down and see the kids interact with other adults as well, not just me being the coach all the time. It's good for the kids to show respect to other adults as well as other kids. Out of school activities really uh, strengthen and build the communities by involving the children and the adults. The kids are loving it, they're learning new skills and it's just, yeah, it's helping them to grow. It's been one of the best programs that I've seen come to Onslow.